Welcome back. All right, let's take a look at what's trending with digital producer Trent Gilbreth. I know what I wanted to say at the top of the show when we were talking about football. I looked at my girls and I said, yeah. this game is going to be nothing compared to tomorrow night's football that you're going to watch. And I really agree. Ram, I mean, Ram. you know, they took zoo, Brady out. Licking, the licking, zoo, zoo. I am yes. so excited. Trent, this so is great. a big deal it's for TCU. It's a Cinderella story, baby, and it we can't is. wait. But since we're talking about faith and really being faith-filled, let's talk Sister Act real quick, and then yes. we'll get into some dogs and frogs. Whoopi Goldberg, she's been talking about for years. Sister Act 3, she has script in hand now. And I feel like that's in large part to Hocus Pocus doing so well on yes. Disney+. Plus. So off that motivation, and the great Kathy and Jimmy might reprise her role as well. She says, Whoopi says, well, first of all, Lynette got in our comments on Facebook, Sister Act and Sister Act 2, Back in the Habit, are my go-to movies when I want to feel good. Oh. We so agree. That's, wait, Trent, you know I told Karen in the commercial yes. break I never saw it. Like, either I'm, or just no neither act, oh my oh, god everybody's mad Catholic at me roots? but this is because she said that there there's like a little um cultural abyss that i fell into during that time okay, i think that's the, when the I, early 90s I, yes i was working already watch with the girls it's a whole family okay film. got it she's been making the press tour circuit with a lot of things but she likes to give like cameos to each and every person so tonight show host jimmy fallon drew barrymore she's like you want to be in sister act three that's you want to be in sister act awesome. three you know she really needs in it is dame maggie smith of yes. course she's the ultimate she's the mother superior in the film. She's now 88 years old, but we hope she makes a return. Let's take a look at Hail Holy Queen. <laughs> the highest note I the thought. The highest note. Okay, can't wait. Get in our Facebook page. And dogs and frogs are going to go head to head tonight on ESPN. So we can't wait. As Christine said, it is hunker down day. So share your red and black. I am class of 2012 horned frogs. So I'll be wearing purple, drinking purple mocktails. I'm in my dry January moment. You're doing great, Trent. I'm oh, so I'm proud of you. Hanging on like a cat on a hot tin roof <laughs> or a frog, I guess. But we have a lot on our Facebook page and 11alive.com. Uh, really looking at high school rankings. Our coaches, Kirby Smart. We have Sonny Dykes, who's in his first season and killing it. Amazing. Amazing. I'm so proud of our QB, Max Duggan, but of course he's going to go head to head. Now this, just a little moment, I'm very proud of 11 Alive for showing this coverage. Hypno Toad is really big these past few seasons. It's actually from Futurama. We've kind of taken it over and we it's kind of a way to like intercept the, the rival when they're kicking a field goal attempt. Really? Yeah, yeah. It's a whole like it's a whole psychedelic thing? Gen Z cool. thing. Okay. Gen, yeah, thank yeah. you. No wonder I don't know about it. Okay. <laughs> cool. Do, um, National Law Enforcement Appreciation Day, of course. Share your love for our officers, our deputies, and everyone across Georgia. And one more. Cheryl Priam last week celebrated this amazing Gwinnett County woman. Her name is Julia. Um, can't think, but her 100th birthday, and she's in Swanee, and we love her. Oh, wow, 100th birthday. Happy 100. Ramos. And, guys, thank you so much for tuning in today. Can't wait to hear what you think about the game. Don't forget ATL and Co. on Facebook. Go dogs. Sorry. Hey, frog. Today's Atlanta.